An already challenging human rights environment marked by systemic violations of rights, even by law enforcement officers, have, has collapsed into a state of anarchy and total disregard for international law as elements of Seleka turned their vengeance against the population. Under Rule 37, Expectations are high among the people of the CAR regarding the outcome of this particular meeting of the Security Council, and there's a growing, as there is a growing sense of despair among the population that see no immediate reprieve to the ordeal that presently confront them. There is expectation that the international community would show solidarity with their plight and decide on some clear steps to bring an end to the impunity with which armed groups have unleashed a reign of terror on the entire population. These serious threats to peace and security of the people of the CR and the Central African region renders the reestablishment of security and the rule of law in the CAR the highest priority issue. It is critical that the Council unequivocally pronounces itself on the need for these abuses to be stopped now and for perpetrators to be individually held accountable for their action. We believe that the time is ripe for this council to consider the imposition of individual sanctions against the architects and perpetrators of these gross violations. We do not <coughs> want a desperate population to be left with no choice but to take the law into their own hands. On behalf of the Council, Nicola the Mr. Nicola Changai, the Committee